Hey guys, welcome back to Legion TD2. Let's see what we're going here. I want to check the Legion spells as well. Dark Ritual, Hero, Adventure, YOLO, Insta Pick. I want to try my luck again and see if we can get a good cash out roll. No. <laughs> I'm hoping for that 270 starter, you know? I'm always getting the XX, the Millenniums, the Bunks. Eh. But we could start Violet, but that's useless. So, simple Pyro start. The Dragon healing. How can I make use of that? They're not getting a good luck from me. They don't deserve it. Do I pick this? This this is a good combo. This is my arcane. I don't need the tempest really, but that's my pierce damage, right? I mean I've done the Komata as well. I might reroll it anyways. It works with with uh what are you looking at? It works very well with the uh Sea Dragon. Sea Dragon is pretty high DPS. Don't have any expensive units now, I know that. But yeah, it's not too bad with Pyro because I can push the Broker right away, but I can push it early anyways, right? Um Nail, that's nice. But here at this point I would already be even, I would just have a little bit less gold. Um What are we working with? Oh again. Akura. I don't think I have any pressure on three. Or I could be interested. Did he just hold that? I don't think he wanted to hold. I think he wanted to claw Pixie to die, right? That was not good. I don't think that's what he wanted. Because that's how much? Six Mephium? He just lost. Could be huge. Um, with one more attack. We're definitely doing the fifth worker. And I think we're just not building and we're just waiting. We're seeing how many workers this guy pushes here. He's currently at 210 value. And we'll, we'll see. If it's four or six, we can get devil fishes. Should I show them? No. I don't, I don't know. I mean, he can only really go for six or seven. For seven, I can get the Nicomata, but yeah, I, I'd, I'd say we just we just see what happens. So right now, I would need at least ninety-five gold, but I might just add more. So 95 and 60 would be 155. Yeah, we're just adding the Nikomata and buffing. Five workers is fine for level four. But I see no reason to show him right away what we have. But yeah, that's not much better than, than Devilfish, really. I could also go Butcher. That's a bit tricky because Pyro has some range and Butcher does not. Ah, oh, let's end here. It might work. Um, so, Devilfish. I would build it here. I would build the Nekomata here. We go like this. If we didn't send, we would have exactly the gold that I needed, so. But this is, this is more than overbuild already, what I have here. I'm supposed to be 50 valley below, but this should be easy. Theoretically. I don't see how a pyro is doing bad here. I look at this. Pyro is still untouched or and the wave is basically dead. No, this wasn't even close. And I think this was a full sense, so... Yeah, the Dark Mage, interesting. Not gonna be a leak though. 
The Kur is gonna survive. Too strong here. Yes, my, my teammate is playing a risky strategy. I'm not sure if it's so good for me to risk a lot. But I will cover this way for him. If necessary. I want to see his five workers. <laughs> He's not in any danger right now. Uh, six could be interesting. Um, right now I'm aiming for Butcher. But yeah, as I said, Butcher is melee. Ira has 300 range. That's 200 range more than the Butcher. Could be a bit dangerous. You're right though. Do we go six? His split is super bad. From what I'm seeing, right? And I don't see him being any good against Dragon Turtle. Actually, ah. Uh, Oh. I can still send rest 7. I think this might make him leak though. Wait, we actually even have 30 gold. I can even give my Nikomata another stack. Yeah, let's save the rest. What did he get? Warwick Gargoyle. I don't think that's enough. I think I have him here. Oh, he got another... No, I don't have him here. Does his teammate leak? No, he's, he didn't receive a set. So. This actually works somewhat because it's, it's his main DPS. Yeah, whatever. So we didn't get a scent, right? We're going for the easy solution, I guess. And then... Yeah, we add this here and we can add the sea dragons in front. Don't really want to split either. I think this is okay. Not planning to be good here. But no aura, so... I do fine. We'll see. Nikomata has to hard carry here. Hopefully we'll get a lot of last hits here. As Pyro helps. I see my teammate leaking already though. Oh Nikomata ah, survived quite long there actually in the end. Come on, now it's the strength of the Pyro. And they're all low. Yeah, we got it. And they both leak. We're actually healing a little bit right now. Recent. Um, yeah, that's fine for me. Is that an upgraded? No, this is a cursed casket. Um, what are we resending? I think we can add another dragon turtle, so this should be fine. Yeah. That was good. That's a good build. The Nikomata survived very long. Like, especially when it was low HP, it was getting lasted after lasted. Mm, my plan here would be to just add a sea dragon, but add it here so it doesn't get fully run over. I need more? I think I can already go towards anti-10 now. Not sure yet how that will look like though. Because Tempest have 300 range. If I build a Leviathan in front, it's just gonna full rip. Or maybe not against 10. Ah, it's difficult to say. I, I, need a, I need a full tank, I feel like. But not important yet. It leaks again. It's okay. Happens. Is this a leak? Come on. No. Oh. I hate this. Do we reroll for anti-10? 
I, I feel like my my plan with the Leviathan would be quite good, but I can't add any Tempest to it. We didn't get a Scent here also, so... Honestly, I think it's better here because I doubt we're going to add Flying units to the front unless it's a Phoenix. So I'd rather want to add it here. But we need a full tank. I, I got to reroll. Okay, Berserker is an option and that's the only option, pretty much. That's not good. I was hoping for something else. What do we get rid of then? I kind of need this for here. Uh, do we need... Now we don't need... Like, Nicomata is a good early game unit. It's not really good to spam it. So I think we're just going with this. I know no arcane defense, but we have a lot of swift. Maybe too much swift. Keep this fighter for now. He made leaked again. Uh, he's not having a good game. I feel for him. Hmm. I think we're going Brutes and Snails because of the Berserker. Though it would probably be good if I have this Berserker not tank this wave. Let's see. It, I, I mainly just wanted to not tank. Like later on I will build fatalizers in front as well. Although it's not a full tank, I know that as well. But here I just I just wanted to not get focused early on so it can actually get some value off. Yeah, it dies now though. There's no way I'm killing anything here. I can just hope to get it to low HP, but not even that. And my teammate would have done a pretty good Fiesta game here, actually. <laughs> Unfortunately, he's not Fiesta. Did he pick again? Was it? Oh, it was YOLO. Oh, this will be hard now. I think that's Dark Ritual. Venture could be interesting as well. But Dark Ritual is, is it gives us the, the gold immediately. Okay, we king it or YOLO. Okay. I, I would I would just say king. Um I wanna build this. I wanna build this. I'm not sure yet which unit my carry is, but I have healing now. <laughs> I don't think a single pyro will be the carry. So we'll have to see. Maybe the fatalizers, but I have no unit that really like okay, I have units that can take advantage from the lifesteal, but I don't have any armor modifiers. Though I can only play with the natural armors. Did we get a scent here? Oh, we did. Yes, I'm on 11 workers. I'm apparently 350 value over. Okay, I guess I forgot to push after 10 then. I'm not sure. But it makes it seem like I'm very strong right now. All right, sir. Oh. So I have one more spot free here behind the butcher that I can definitely free up with the polywalk. I think there's definitely going to be a spot for Fatalizer. 
That's 545 gold. A little more valued. I don't think I need this. I can probably shift some gold towards big units. I'll still have the bazooka. Hmm. This Fateless is fast. This Sakura, I... He did it so good with the Sakura. Can't really say it otherwise. He always gets some acro towards it and it never dies. Uh, should be... I don't think they can resend that much, can they? Looks like meat is back on the menu, boys. Yeah, this is not too sure actually. He has need to shift even more gold, but that would have mean meant less workers. Okay, 300 only. I should be able to hold my lane. Because this is really not a big send. But I don't know how much of my teammates' lane I can hold. Because he got a big send. We have only a few attack upgrades. That's problematic. Our surviving would be quite nice. Uh, now I have nothing that they can heal. I mean, they heal him themselves, kind of, because of the lifesteal. Is that enough to survive for the leak? Oh. <laughs> Four golems and two ogres. Ah, we don't have enough attack for this, I think. No, we don't have enough. Damn. That was tricky. The um, yeah, the guy I'm sending to, I uh, the Sakura. It really, really hurts that I that I can't really break a Sakura. It shouldn't be that hard, right? It shouldn't be hard to break a Sakura. But I can't do it. I guess I gotta play it and, and figure out where the weak waves are because the, the split he did was so good. Like his build wasn't even it didn't even look complicated or anything. Like he started like this and he already had like like more than half or like half half. And he added like this. Half a spot away from the wall. And from that point on, he had minimal lit on the left. He didn't leak anything. Wait. Did he leak seven? Apparently he leaked seven. Wait, I'm a bit confused. I'm pretty sure I checked on wave 12 and he had 11 stacks on his Sakura. How does that work? Maybe it was 10 and I misread, but I don't know. His splits were so good. He didn't, I mean, yeah, he had mostly, mostly, uh, mostly tank units there. I wonder if it's even worth to add like a second Sakura at some point, if you know that you're, that this will always hold. Because that way you can actually, you, you actually have a very strong unit. I wonder, does it get counted as, oh, it, it actually counts as 15 extra value as well every round. Which I guess is fair. Same like Hydra that, that has like varying um, value. But even if he doesn't build anything because the Sakura survived, he actually got stronger. Yeah. Okay. Thanks for watching. Um, gotta figure out a way against that. But, uh, yeah, see you next time. Bye bye.